There's magic in the air. You can feel it everywhere. Just like sunshine, just like winter snows. It's a wonder in the wind that blows. Would you like to see some magic that will thrill you to the core? Or a trip that's so fantastic you'll be calling out for more? It's a show by Mother Nature from the forest to the shore. There are wonders to confound you. There's mystery all around you. Would you like to know some secrets quite remarkable but true? Can you tell me why a squirrel can fly? What makes a lake so blue? Well, it's natural resourcery, and have I got news for you. There are wonders to astound you. There's mystery all around you. A single handful of soil contains more living organisms than there are people on the Earth. Magic. And a kangaroo baby weighs just a half an ounce at birth. It's magic. I've got a factory that's turning out the straightest concrete trees. They stand in perfect rows and don't need pesky birds and bees. Forget it, Herb. Dr. Wilderness and Nature. He's a wizard and a teacher. He's a friend to every feature. The magic never stops when you're a friend of ducks. I'm glad you're here. Relax. Come in, sit down. Let's talk. My friends, the flowers and the birds, just call me Doc. There's magic in the air. Come on, let's take a walk. There's magic in the air. There's magic everywhere. There is magic in the air. There's magic everywhere. Just like old town San Diego grew from that little Indian village a long time ago into the fantastic city that it is today. With 1.2 million diverse and dedicated people, including you, saving resources and making the choices that really do make a difference today and tomorrow. Choices that you guys can make, like conserving and protecting water. Thank you very much. Hey, remember, where water flows, life grows. Thank you very much. the adventures of America's foremost environmental magician. He was blinded by greed and driven to take the most from the life that he was living. He never shared much that he was given. He just hogged the whole thing. Parkin 
moving. Ours is a sad pigtail of a hog going wild and wasteful. He let the faucet trip for hours. He let the garden hose run in his bed of flowers. He took long, hot, soapy showers. That reminds me, what do you get when you cross a pig with a pine tree? I don't know. A porcupine! Oh, I get it. <laughs> He's now a playful of pork and beans. The Dr. Wilderness Show. The natural world has never been so magical. Yeah.